हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ईसी एकेडमी इन दिस लेक्चर लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड द सर्कुलर फ्रीक्वेंसी शिफ्ट प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ डीएफटी फर्स्ट लेट अस राइट द स्टेटमेंट इफ डीएफटी ऑफ एक्स ऑफ एन इज इक्वल टू एक्स ऑफ के देन वी कैन राइट the dft of x of n e to the power of j 2 pi by n into ln can be written as x of k minus l mod n so here it states that if we take the dft of time domain signal which is multiplied with exponential term e to the power of j 2 pi by n into ln then the frequency domain signal will be having a circular shift with the value of l since in exponential term we have taken ln so with that value l the x of k value will be having a, a circular a shift let us prove we know dft of the sequence can be given as x of k that is equal to summation of n is equal to 0 to n minus 1 x of n e to the power of minus j 2 pi by n into k n for k value ranging between 0 to n minus 1 in this above equation let us put k is equal to k minus l so if you put k is equal to k minus l the above equation will be x of k minus l so i will write this as the circular shift with mod n that will be equal to summation of n is equal to 0 to n minus 1 x of n e to the power of minus j 2 pi by n in place of k let us write k minus l k minus l into n we can write the above equation as uh, summation of n is equal to 0 to n minus 1 x of n we can split the exponential term we can write it as e to the power of minus j 2 pi by n into k into n into e to the power of minus j 2 pi by n into minus l so if you multiply minus with this sign it will be plus l n now we know this term this is nothing but x of k so we will write that as x of k into e to the power of j 2 pi by n into ln we can write x of k as dft of x of n so this term is nothing but dft of x of n so along with this we will multiply e to the power of j 2 pi by n into ln so towards left hand side it is x of circular convolution k minus l mod n so this is the proof for circular frequency shift property of dft i hope you have understood the topic thank you